WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and currently we have a sea of green out here. All the U.S. indices trading to the upside. The leader is the semis. They're up 4%, 94 points out there. The Dow is up on 1.5%. Same with the S&P. Same with the NASDAQ. That's 491, 58, and 168 points to the upside. Gold up nearly 3%, trading out at 1677. That's up 46 buckaroonies. Silver's up a dollar and a quarter. That's up 6.5%. Lights recruit up 4%. 354 is... Uh, is where is how high is trade. It's up bad uh, trading out at ninety one seventy one. Natural gas up six pennies and a thirty treasury is back ten ticks. She's trading out at one twenty. Even Steven. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. As we do, we begin with the ES mini upper left hand corner. Price right now, uh, if it can close above the the center of its daily profile, that's at four thousand. Should be able to do that, but oh, hold on a minute here. Uh, that's not correct. It's at 37.43. Hello, Stevie. Wake up. There you go. If price can close above that today, then we should be able to see a run up to 38.38, maybe even back to the highs of 38.97. That'll be especially true if the spot volatility continues to move lower. It's trading well below its 50 day exponential moving average. That is a bullish directional signal for the S&P 500. The NQ, we know that it has support down at the bottom of its weekly profile, 10.734. But the question is, can it get back inside its daily profile? So, so far, as nice of a bounce as this has been with regard to the NASDAQ 100 or the NQ, it's got resistance at 10.917. That's the level price needs to close above today. U.S. dollar index, you can see a descending trend line out there that acted as resistance. Price may move back to the support of its daily profile. That would be at 109.81. Goldilocks consolidating right now with inside its daily profile. Its resistance level is at 1682.10. During the Trader's Edge show, we'll take a look at the weekly time frame chart for gold because that is the key chart to let us know whether this is just a counter trend move or is it something else. Silver, nice big wide ranging bar. It's taking out a B point of an A to B equals CD. The 101 one price projection will be 2083. I doubt that that's what it's going to do with today's bar. More likely headed to 2139. Lightspeed crude. Right up at resistance, the top of its daily and weekly profile, the weekly profile high, 91.58. We're trading at 91.61. Natural gas consolidating with inside its daily profile. Support, 568. Resistance, 636. And that 30-year treasury still below the bottom of its daily profile. So there's nothing really good to report on there. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show. But if you're off to start your Friday, have a fantastic one. And we look forward to seeing you again next week. Take care.